calendar will tell you that it's November 5th, but in actuality, it's Meatball's 8th birthday. There you go. Okay, you ready? Now order. What are you gonna get? You want a puppy cup? I think you're choosing Starbucks, so can I get started? Please? Hey, can Meatball have a pup cup for his birthday? Well, of course he can. Happy birthday, Meatball. You're gonna get a pup cup? We are making the most out of this blessing, and that is eight years ago, an angel decided to come to Earth and allow me the privilege of taking care of him. Up. Baby Jesus, Turkey Day, and Meatball's birthday. You're in good company. Well, Meatball has a tradition that every year he gets a meatball. The very first one, he almost burnt his nose. Historically, traditionally gets a turkey meatball on his birthday. And guess who didn't go shop? I forgot, I forgot. So I need to go inside and get them. I'm not leaving him in the car. I have the top off, the doors. Anyway, meatball, you're going into Trader Joe's. We'll be out of there before they tell us you're not allowed to be there. You ready? Let's just get turkey meatballs. <laughs> is coming back to Facebook or a new, I don't know, a new either generation of Meatball followers. Some people don't know his story. Some people don't know he began with uh, complications and a disability. They don't know. They don't know why he's named Meatball. Some people don't know. Um, the imperfect puppy. I'm perfect puppy. Oh, don't act bored. That's Meatball's footprint when he was a baby. Gray skies seem normal when one has never experienced how blue they actually can be. I guess I always felt alone. Even my baby picture has the definite wedge in between them and myself. My siblings had titles already. Sold, it says. Taken, it meant. Nobody wanted me. But why? Is it my pink nose? Don't I love the same? Can't I prove myself worthy? The odious word that hovered above me was available. Available undeveloped problem. Who is gonna take a chance on loving an imperfect puppy? Sadly, no one has ever touched me or loved me, and by my weight and malnourishment, even my mother has given up on me. Who's to say how it happened, but 300 miles away, a very nice man decided he wanted me. 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 I don't walk too well, I'm a little twitchy and humpbacked, yet he desires me. Does he know about the adjectives? Does he know about the words that describe the unwanted? Will he love the imperfect puppy? Does he know that I need help? No, he doesn't know. He came all this way because he believes that I'm perfect. When he sees me, he might change his mind. Maybe I can fake a couple extra steps. No, wait, he wants me regardless and he told me that I'll be okay. For the first time, I have hope. Wait, he didn't inspect me at all. The nice man scooped me up towards his neck and called me Meatball. The road was long and the naps were plentiful. We drove all day and into the night until we finally arrived at our new home. All this for me? My world had just got a whole lot brighter and before I could celebrate, the nice man immediately took me to a sweet lady doctor so I could be inspected. That's when I heard the words for the first time, cerebral palsy, cerebral hyperplasia, more bad names, and none of them describe my ability to love. I'm a pass-by pooch, a pass-by pooch, and now the nice man who I was hoping would be my forever daddy will more than likely give up on me too. But he didn't. In fact, he worked with me and encouraged me to take six steps instead of five, then 10 and then 20. And then he taught me to run. I can run, I can run fast, just like any other puppy. It wasn't long until I realized that the only difference between imperfect and I'm perfect is just a little space and perspective. Meatball, are you ready for your birthday? Are you ready for your birthday party? 
Are you ready for your birthday party? We're going to split it in half. You're going to share your time with Instagram and then Facebook. What do you think about that? Do, do, do. Oh, I know. just finished the Instagram live video uh, party and it was chaotic. <laughs> chaotic. So because I'm running a YouTube video, I really want to be able to say the proper thank yous to everybody and represent each card, but there's no way we can go through every card during that period. But that does not mean that we're not grateful. It's just that, yeah. Meepo, you are wild at your party. Meepo's wild. Well, if Meepo hasn't had enough excitement, we just did the Instagram live birthday party. It's now time for the Facebook version, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. <laughs> scene of the crime and I realize where's Meatball? Where's the guest of honor? What happened? What happened? You tired? <laughs> okay. I know. Too much fun? Too much fun? Happy birthday, baby. Happy birthday, Meatball. I'm gonna be watching you 
for a very long time. Oh, I'm watching you. Uh-huh. For a very long time, sweetheart. Thank you.